Welcome back to part four, unit three, chapter two, word 2016. The essential outcomes, you'll be utilizing open and closed software, as well as updating your portfolio for career development. In this PowerPoint, we will be talking about smart art graphics. There are a variety of different types of smart art. You have list, process, style, st cycle, a couple sets of hierarchy, relationships, matrix, pyramids, and pictures. To access smart art, go to the insert tab, find the illustration ribbon. You will see a listing of all the different types of smart art you will select the one that you want to use such as process and then you will go in there and have different types of options for the smart art of your choosing open up the smart art graphic text box place cur a cur your cursor after the first bullet in the box type in your data. This is the first level. Do not put your cursor in the graphic boxes. When you have typed the SmartArt text box, text will appear in the text box and in the graphics. Farm Animals is the name of our graphic art. To go to the next level, hit enter. On the second line, Find the Demote icon under the Smart Art Design tab and look for the Create Graphic Ribbon. Click on Demote. Your cursor will be on the second level, moving the graphic underneath the first level Farm Animal box. Type in Cows. This puts the Cows title underneath Farm Animals. Hit Enter and this will add the remaining second level data. In the example above, all second level text has been added. Now let's add a third level data that goes underneath each second level farm animal type. Adding the third level. Place your cursor at the end of the word cows. Hit the enter key once. Demote the bullet one level. Hit the demote key once. Notice that a third level appears underneath the cow box. Type in the third level data. In this case, underneath cows, we typed in Jersey, Holstein, and Swiss. To add the data for the rest of the animal farm animals, Follow the same procedure given in this slide. If you notice, underneath cows, we have a list that all apply to the cows. You'll do the same thing for dogs, pigs, and cats. Promoting in SmartArt. To go back up a level, place the cursor at the end of the Swiss name and hit enter. Then click on the Promote icon, which will take you up a level. Type in the data Pig. The end result is as follows. You will see three levels. You have your first level, which is the farm animals. The second level, which is cows, dogs, and cats. And the third level, is the list that goes underneath each of the second level items. So under cows, we have Jersey, Holstein, Swiss. Dogs, we have Collie, German Shepherd, Pug. And under cats, Calico, Siamese, and Tiger. To exit out of the text box, Click on the X in the top right corner of the text box. To 
adding color and style to SmartArt. To add color, use the Change Colors drop-down icon. Make sure you click on the SmartArt to open the tools. To add a style, go to the SmartArt Styles ribbon and click on the drop-down arrow. Congratulations, you have just finished Part 4. Download the Unit 3, Chapter 2, Activity 2 document from the class website. Save it to your Chapter 2 folder on your flash drive. Open up the document. Go to the end of the document and insert the cycle Continuous Cycle Smart Art. On the previous page, there are five steps. Cut and paste the first step into the top Smart Art block. Go back and cut the second step and place it inside the second block going clockwise around the Smart Art. Continue the cutting and pasting of the steps until you have all five steps into SmartArt. For the next set of instructions, go to the next slide. Add color of your choosing to the SmartArt. Add a SmartArt style to the SmartArt. Change the heading style for steps to a heading one style. Make sure you save your document. Congratulations, you have finished all four PowerPoint presentations. Before moving on, make sure you show your last class activity to your teacher.